So we finna see a ghost. Please don't do nothing to blow that hot ass breath from my... Y'all see it? Oh my fucking God, it's like four of them bitches. What's up, Tatagators, and welcome back to another gameplay. So as y'all can see, we have something new, and it is called Phasmophobia. This is actually a highly requested game from TikTok, and we're finally playing it. Before we get into this gameplay, I do want to say thank y'all so much for 60K Gators. I do apologize for not being active with commenting or replying to y'all's comments. For like this whole week, I've been having like a little stomach ache. I haven't really been feeling good, but your girl, we ain't finna stop grinding now. When y'all see me responding to y'all comments, you know your girl back and recovered. So give me some time. But I do have to make a video for y'all because y'all, y'all my gators, the fuck? So again, thank y'all so much for 60K and let's please play this Phasmophobia because I'm I'm dying to see what this about. I don't wanna die though. Okay, so this is tutorial. I'm so confused on how to fucking play this. I'm gonna be honest because I was, I done made like three different intros. I don't know what the fuck this is. Um, So we just put training mode because the little lobby they had me in was confused as hell, confusing as hell. So we in a train mode. We we finna get to training. Okay, here at Ghost Hunting Distribution, we'd like to welcome blah blah. So start grab a flashlight behind you. Do we show you how to do that? You can toggle the flat bitch. Tell me how to use the shit. Okay, oh okay, okay. Grab with E, place with F, drop with G. I'm not gonna remember that. E F G, okay. Or I'm I'm probably gonna remember. E F G. Y'all gonna remember that? Okay, grab with E. Okay, use mouse too. Oh, I, I I like that. Okay, um, you can cycle through your held items to change which one you are holding. You can carry three items at once. How you do that? Cycle, girl. This look at all these fucking letters we have to remember. E A F G E E F G Q T. Bitch, I'm not gonna. Who the fuck gonna remember all that? Journal with J. Y'all got me fucked up. Y'all got me. F I'm not gonna remember all this. Special with T. That ain't working. Q. What the fucking fuck? Okay, that's how I go through through the shit. Girl, get the fuck out of here because y'all stressing me out already. Um. So how I get out of here? That's that's need to be the next. Oh, we got a key, y'all. I don't like how it it. This gonna be a hard ass game because it don't let you know you can select it. I like games that let me know you can select this shit. Gra okay, grab the key to the right, then interact with the keypad to the left. Oh, interact with the bitch. We ain't gonna make it. Ghostbusters my ass, they got the wrong person for this shop. Okay, how you interact? Again, Q. Interact with mouse one. This is hard. Ain't no way that flashlight on and it's that fucking dark. That flashlight ain't on. It might be on on y'all screen, but when I'm playing the game, it's dark. Your first goal when entering a hunted location is to find the ghost's favorite room. This is a room where the ghost will spend the majority of his time in the living room. That's what them bitches always be in the living room watching nothing on the screen. To find the ghost room, look out for open doors, items that have been thrown, or sounds coming from that area to that bitch mad. That's a mad ghost. When playing higher difficulties, we just gonna play easy. Ghosts can change their favorite room when one that's fucked up. To open a door, interact with it and move forwards. To to open a door, interact with it and move forward. Why did it open like that? Bitch, open all the way. Look at this flashlight. Ain't no way in hell. We might as well turn the flashlight off. This ain't doing nothing for me. Bitch, it ain't got high beams. This ain't doing nothing for me. Oh, we got a pencil. We might need to write in our journal. Pick it up. Oh, it, it lights up to let you know you can use it. Oh, Head that's the door to the next section. Bitch, I wouldn't finish. I know what you, I know where I go. What the fuck? It never said you could throw stuff with that. What? The baby, the ghost up in here, because that ain't me. Okay, y'all, I'm slow as shit. Okay, E? Is it, was it EKG? Where the pencil went? 
uh, mouse one interact. Thank you for telling me that, baby. Thank you. Open all the way. Why does it do that? Room number two. Girl, this room fucked up. This is like an acting session. Can we read that? Look, I'm picking up all type of shit. Oh, okay. We, we got the keyboard that we can't even read. Okay. We got some coffee. You bitch, don't pick that up. You don't know who stank ass breath been on that. Okay, room number two. Wait, was the ghost in the first room? Because it said, like, be aware of items that have been thrown. Ooh, some donuts. Bitch, we not gonna be fat. I think we could run. Something is chasing after us. Room number three. It's just the same shit. This is like an acting session. Room. Okay. What the fuck is that? Let's read. Each investigator, we're an investigator again. Bitch, we gotta finish Amanda. We can't do all these investigating shit. Okay, team sanity. I don't know if I should play this with people or without. Each investigator has their own sanity level represented in the truck by a percentage on a screen. When playing in a team, you will also have an average sanity level. Several things can lower your sanity. Standing in the dark, oh bitch. Ghost events and abilities, you can restore your sanity level by using bitch by. Oh, this sanity medication, get it. Okay, how do I use it? Oh, this is gonna be one hell of a game. Good job. I'm about to have all day playing with this shit. Okay, this is too much reading. To keep your sanity stable, you should stand in lit rooms or areas as much as possible. You can turn the fuse back by interacting with the switch. So am I supposed to purposely let my sanity? I don't know where my sanity at. Girl, turn the shit back on. Wait, I could play shit too? With F, okay. The door's locked. Wait, why the fuck did the lights go out or did it? Off on alternative, alternative fuse box. This is gonna be a hard game. Try tripping the fuse box by playing with the lights to the right. Then turn the fuse box back on. All that confusion I just went through, I'm probably not going to keep that edited in. Because that shit took like 10 minutes. I'm not going to lie. Okay. Now something should get the popping out. That's still locked. It says by playing with the lights to the right, then turn the fuse box back on. But I just did. Okay, now can we turn it? Well done. Electromagnetic fields. Bitch, this is based on real life. I know exactly what the fuck that is. Us carbonated beings have that. Shut the fuck up. In a normal contract, you will only need to find up to three evidence types before the bitch. I wonder how much we get. Because contracts are serious. So we must be getting millions of dollars. And if we die, it's up to us because we signed the bullshit. Okay. But for this training, we'll be showing you all seven. EMF spots are left behind on almost everything. I hate. I, I don't mind reading, but damn. Grab your EMF reader. Okay. Turn it on with the use. Okay. Then move it towards objects that a ghost has recently interacted with. That shit in there. Okay. Some ghost types will leave stronger EMF hotspots. Damn. If your EMF reader is displacing a strength of five or higher, this is evidence. Open your journal by pressing the journal button. Click the evidence tab at the top of the page. Then mark EMF5 as checked. Journal with J. Okay. No, turn it on. Okay, this shit ain't been touched with. What the fuck? This one is high. I bet you it's this nice one. Nice work. Bitch, I didn't even do nothing. It didn't even go over five. Okay, he said over five now. He said nice work too, but. Okay, I wonder if this one. Okay, we just need to go ahead because they ain't going over five. Ultraviolet, ain't that blue purple shit? Yes. 
Oh, I'm a little fuck out of this game because I did some readings on this shit. Okay, grab with E, Tater Gator. Why do I keep moving? Okay, I think I have too much in my... I have too much in my inventory. It's not letting me use the insanity juice. So I have to throw you and save room for you. Okay, I like this. The training is going well. Some ghost types will leave behind UV handprints on doors, windows, and even footprints on the floor if they walk into some well-placed salt. To find these, listen out for par paranormal interactions on those objects, then grab your UV light, activate it with use, then shine it around to see what prints have been left. If you find UV handprints or footprints, make sure to note them down on the evidence page in your journal. Bitch, I haven't even been using a journal. Lastly, if you shine UV lights onto a print for long enough, it will become charged, allowing you to swap to a camera to snap a quick photo for some extra cash. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. So I think we have to go back in this room. Do I get down here? How do I use it? Oh, I think it'll just... That bitch is in here. Okay, so she... Her handprints ain't on this. I wonder if this got like a specific... What the fuck? Journal. Well done. Oh my, he scared the fuck out of me. Don't do that now. Evidence. Ultraviolet. Using the evidence we found, we believe the ghost is a phantom, poltergeist, demon, hantu girl. What the fuck is all that? The mimic. Y'all got me fucked up. Y'all think I'm gonna be dealing with that? Get the fuck out of here. Resume. Okay, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna love the fuck out of this game. I'm so glad we started off with training. So when we actually play the real game, freezing temperatures. Ghosts are known for making the area around them colder, but some ghost types will push these temperatures below freezing. Some ghost types will push these below freezing. Oh, bitch, they trying to kill us. They're be below freezing? When navigating around a location, you may notice your breath being frozen in front of you. Oh, bitch, we did. Visualized by a cold cloud of air. If you find this, it may be worth checking the temperature of the room accurately. Y'all, we got a lot of shit to do. This is like, think fast. To do so, grab a thermometer. We grab with E. So just fuck the shit I'm using then. Okay, uh, how do we how do we change it like that? So I don't know if we're gonna need these because we, we're what you beating at? How the fuck you drop? Okay. Yeah, I think since it's training, we we only gonna need this. Wait, pick it up with E. There we go. To do so, grab a thermometer and walk into each room, then check the temperatures as they adjust. You're looking for anything below freezing. Zero and thirty-two. If you find freezing temperatures, mark it in your journal. Zero Celsius thirty-two Fahrenheit. I'm pretty sure this door is locked, right? Yeah. Do I just press the left button? How would I know? Like, I never, I don't think I read a thermometer before, but this is fun. I'm trying to make sure I don't have to, like, activate it. It's actually cold in real life. Oh, I could run on here, but she gets tired fast. What the fuck? None of these rooms are cold. And y'all don't give me no more rooms. Okay, let me see what I'm doing wrong. So let's just stand here. Maybe we're supposed to just stand still and that bitch will drop or go up. That It's not doing nothing. Oh my God, it is. We supposed to stand in this bitch and let her take us. I don't think this is the room... Okay, yeah, we supposed to stand in this bitch. Don't stop above it either, because that's cheating, bitch. Just get right to it so we can finish this shit. I think it's going to get right to it because it's training, and it's just letting me know how to use it. Okay, take the journal out. Move to the next room. Oh, my God. So, I have never took my journal out for the EMF, the ghost writing. Wait, I don't think I ever did ghost writing. The EMF, 
I don't know what the fuck that is. Ghost orb, spirit by girl bitch. Do is it a? a I, I think I'm I'm a I'm not gonna do so well if I'm tested for my training because I didn't take my journal out for the others. What the fuck is this green shit? Okay, the D O T S projectors lets us see things that normal light does not. Sometimes using this light will reveal a small flicker into the paranormal world. Several ghost types can be revealed with a dots projector. All you need to do is find them. Okay, throw the shit. Ooh, that bitch threw like quick. Okay. Oh my God, what the fuck? Okay. Grab a projector, turn it on with the use, and aim the light where you think a ghost may be. If you see a ghostly sahalate appear then you found some evidence try and find a ghostly apparition apparition in the room to the left you can mark then girl look bye i'm sick of reading y'all pissing me off okay when a ghost reveals itself in that form it will walk towards the closest player if they're inside the same room bitch don't touch me funk your breath ass you can use this to get those particular shy ghosts to come within range of your dots why would they come to that though wait i'm supposed to stay in here tater so we finna see a ghost. Please don't do nothing to blow that hot ass breath in my. Y'all see it? Oh my fucking god! It's like four of them bitches. That one coming to look close. Good job. Huh? <gasps> that shut the fuck up, idiot. We believe the ghost is what? Bitch, why all these, why all these circled off? Why, am I supposed to be? Yes, I'm supposed to check my journal. Oh, bitch, we must got a demonic demon. Girl, look at this shit. They look like they got... Fuck it. I don't know what that is, but they got friends. And they just standing there. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, oh, often when filming paranormal, let's pick it up. Throw the shit. Oh my God, we filming in this bitch? Often when filming paranormal evidence with a video camera, investigators have found unexplainable flecks of light that slowly drift across their footage. These have been named ghost orbs, okay. To find them, grab a video camera and turn on night vision with use. I fucks with that. During contracts, you can place the video camera down during contracts, you can place the video camera down and view the camera feed from the safety of the track. Bitch, I'm not gonna remember that. Place the video camera down. How you play shit again with F? Oh, that's, now that's actually tight because they don't throw it. That's actually, hold on. Oh my God, that's raw as fuck. This game took its time with, with how, it's, how it's made. Okay, wait, give me my shit back. Did I get it back? No, okay. Search around the ghost room and look for any small flecks of light moving around. If you find one, mark it in your journal. Don't don't say that good job shit either. Nice work. That's that. I feel like that's too easy. Cause these are not little flex. Don't do too much either. Okay. Oh bitch. Yeah, don't don't do too much either. Cause is it moving? Get the fuck out of here. Just cause it's training don't mean shit. Get the fuck out of here. What is that? Okay, get get this shit on. Okay, so I'm so glad I did training. I know I said that already, but bitch, I would have been so lost if I would have just hopped right into this shit. Okay, ghost writing. Some paranormal, get this shit out of my inventory. Get this shit in my inventory. Okay, pick it up. Some paranormal entities will interact with more objects than others. In several reported cases, ghosts have been known to write vague messages in books if left long enough. What? They, them bitches can write. 
To get ghost writing, evidence grab a ghost writing book and place it down somewhere near the ghost. After some time, the ghost will either throw it, throw the book or write in it. For the latter, note that it okay, yeah. Okay, so do we just place this shit down? So maybe when is it gonna allow me to use everything? That they have showed me. Okay. Oh my god. Well done. Bitch, that ain't no vague message. That bitch said together forever. Bitch, you gone in the fucking astral realm. I don't know what the fuck you talking about some forever for, bitch. Can I read it though? I want to read what the fuck he just said. Okay, ooh, we almost done with our shit. Okay, get the fuck out of here because this is too much. But I do want to see what he just said. It look like it ain't gonna let. Can we jump on here? Fuck no. We finna read what Buddy had to say. Pick this shit up. What the fuck? Place it right here. Why do y'all have it turned that way? That's like pussy as shit. We finna read this. There we go. Yeah. Fuck with me, bitch. Okay. Can I crouch? That's too low. All I see is together forever. With you. I don't know what that first something to with you. Girl, bye. You can't do nothing but go to the astral real. Okay, shut the fuck up. EVP is a spirit box. Oh. Turn that shit off. That sounds stank. Birth hot. EVP recorders or spirit boxes are radio devices designed to scan through different frequencies. Possibly revealing some paranormal activity amongst the static. So use a spirit box, grab one, yes, use it. Make sure that all the room lights in that area are turned off. Then you can ask the ghost questions and hope of a response. Try asking, where are you? Okay, if I get a response, the indicator will flash white. And you should hear a voice that's unique amongst the radio frequencies. If it flashes red, your questions was heard, but you didn't get a reply. Oh, that bitch ain't fucking with me then. Okay. So lights off. We don't need to turn no lights on. Turn it off. Okay. That bitch in this room over here. That bitch over here. That, yep. Ain't no motherfucking way in hell I'm supposed to use a microphone, my actual voice, so it's for this bitch to hear me. Ain't no motherfucking way in hell. Okay, let's let's turn my mic on. This, this is, is crazy. crazy. How, How are, are you? you? We're this we are supposed to use our actual microphone. I don't have my shit set up right now for this shit. That's actually tight as hell, to be honest. But I don't have my microphone set up on here, y'all. Oh, I'm so glad y'all just did that shit. So this is what I'm using right here. Let's... How are you? Where the fuck are you, bitch? Okay. Let me see how much we got left. Because we, we, we're going to beat this part. Oh, wait. The spirit box and the EMF level five. I think we did this one. So, to be honest, we done. We done. Okay. Because I don't have my shit set up. And if I leave this screen, it's going to stop my record. And we definitely don't want it to do that. But we got it, y'all. We got it. Okay. Yeah, we got this shit for real. So just know the next gameplay we will actually be playing. I don't know if y'all want me to play with actual people or just play by myself. So I'm going to leave that up to y'all. Like, should I find some friends to play with? Or if I can't find anyone, I'll just... Should I play with the, the people that they allow me to play with? They mean I got to talk to them. Bitch, I might just fuck around and play by myself. Because, bitch, I don't really like talking to people. So, yes, I do like this game. I'm not even going to lie. Thank y'all for recommending this shit. I didn't know you had to use a real microphone. For them to hear you so of course i'm not gonna beat this unless you know once i turn my camera off and shit um 
But yes, I guess this could complete the tutorial or the little hunt that we are on. This was training, and I feel like our training went good. It was horrible at first, but we got the hang of this shit, and I'm going to love the fuck out of this game. So, y'all stay tuned for the next one.